Brent and Sarah, this is at the intersection of Grand Street with Main Street. These lights here have been installed with the, uh, they turn on right now when it's time for pedestrians to cross the street. And the goal is to make it easier for drivers to see people in the crosswalk rather than just the light from regular street lights. Main Street in Middletown is generally busy with pedestrian traffic. Wait. But it's also busy with cars and safety tends to be a concern. We identified pedestrian lighting as a major concern and identified a pedestrian level light at a signalized intersection as a concept that hasn't really been fully explored. That prompted the city of Middletown to try out that option, adding lights 15 feet above the crosswalk at the intersection with Grand Street to serve more than one purpose. It illuminates the pedestrian and makes them much more visible to motorists and also hopefully encourages the pedestrians to use the crosswalk to cross only during the pedestrian phase. For now, the lights are a pilot program funded by a grant and part of a complete streets effort with the Department of Transportation. The idea of complete streets is that our roadway system is there to work for everybody. So it's not just moving cars, it's looking at uh, pedestrian infrastructure, bicycle infrastructure. 2022 marked the deadliest year for pedestrians in Connecticut in decades. More than 70 people were killed. The work to make the roads safer around the state is ongoing. Building sidewalks, upgrading crosswalks and pedestrian crossing technology, improving lighting and adding illumination. In Middletown, some residents say other improvements made in the past have made a difference. When they changed the crosswalks, I thought it really made it much safer and easier to cross. They made like a bump out so that the you can see down the road easier. So even if the light, if it does say it's okay to walk, you can make sure that people have stopped. And the hope is that the new lighting will be the beginning of more similar changes. Uh, we want to keep everybody that's walking safe. Uh, we want more people walking the streets. Um, people do here. The lights will stay up until the end of the month while the DOT does an evaluation, but the goal is to make these lights a permanent fixture and also to add them to other intersections along Main Street. Live in Middletown, Gabby Molina, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.